Welcome to my new series on the book, The Bible Makes Us Baptists. You know, every year when I was a student at Bible College, a man named Larry Harrison would come and set up his book table in Old Main. I enjoyed looking through his book collection, and I selected various volumes to purchase. One year, while Mr. Harrison was there, I happened upon a work entitled The Bible Makes Us Baptists or formerly, in Edith's days. I took the book home. My dad, in particular, became very excited with this piece of historical fiction. He purchased multiple copies for the church bookstore and encouraged church members to read it. The work was written from the perspective of a young girl growing up in the 1500s in England, when persecution raged against the Baptists. After I began teaching at a Baptist academy post-graduation, I took my class through a unit study of this particular volume. The students and I followed Edith's journey and learned from this work of fiction of the kinds of persecutions endured by our Baptist forebears. I created further materials in 2019 when I revisited the work from a literary and historical perspective in a world history and literature class I taught. Later in this series, I plan to make those resources available for any who wish to study this work in further detail as part of a Christian school or homeschool curriculum. Anyone familiar with the work of G.A. Henty may appreciate a work such as The Bible Makes Us Baptists, which gathers from a variety of historical resources to create a work of historical fiction. So this series, will be comprised of my reading chapter by chapter through the book, The Bible Makes Us Baptists. The series could be enjoyed by adults and children alike. I plan to post one chapter at a time until the entirety of the book has been read. By the time of the final podcast, it is my intent to share the resources available for using The Bible Makes Us Baptists as a unit study in your Christian school or homeschool, as I mentioned before. And now, for the book. The Bible Makes Us Baptists, formerly in Edith's Days, A Tale of Religious Liberty by Mary E. Bamford. Copyright 1894 by the American Baptist Publication Society, published October 1902. To those who have entered into the heritage of religious liberty. Forward. The Bible Makes Us Baptists formerly entitled In Edith's Days, is an allegory that becomes an adventure story laced with real-life characters and historically accurate anecdotes. The story unfolds before us through the eyes of a child and grows through her teen years, young motherhood, and finally through her progeny. It is a tale of faith, devotion, and courage. The book is also a chronicle of crisis and a manual on martyrdom. It personalizes Fox's Book of Martyrs through the voice and eyes of the narrator, Editha. It is history from a feminine perspective of God's word coming to the English-speaking world. Her travails and trials turn Editha into a genuine heroine. On another plane, the story professes the truth that the Book of God births Baptists True Bible believers and practitioners will eventually become Baptists. I make no apology for this statement, especially after reviewing this book. Baptists do champion the truth of religious liberty that grows from the seeds sown by the Word of God. I trust after reading this invigorating and enlightening story, you will have a greater appreciation for the Baptist faith and the book that brought us to the forefront. May you never again take for granted the faith we have been endowed with, and that was purchased at such great price. I trust God will move you to tears and a strengthening of your commitment to him. Evangelist Tim Green, Day Heights, Ohio. This particular copy was printed in December of 2001. The author gives the following as authorities for the facts embodied in this story. Allen. Young Folk's History of the Reformation, Armitage, 
History of the Baptists, Brand, Antiquities, Brown, Memorials of Baptist Martyrs, Crosby, History of the English Baptists, Creighton, Age of Elizabeth, Collier, English Literature, Chambers, Book of Days, D. Abigne, History of the Reformation, De Amasi, Holland and its People, Encyclopedia Britannica, Frode, History of England, Fox, Book of Martyrs, Fisher, History of the Christian Church, Geike, The English Reformation, Green, History of the English People, Haywood, History of All Religions, Hallam, State of Europe during the Middle Ages, Johnson's Cyclopedia, Jones, The Baptists, Cately, History of England, Knight, History of England, Lippincott's Gazetteer of the World, Little, Historical Lights, Lorente, History of the Inquisition, Motley, Rise of the Dutch Republic, Mosheim, Ecclesiastical History, Neil, History of the Puritans, Percy, Tales of Kings and Queens of England, Prescott, History of Philip II, Robinson, History of Baptism, Swinton, Condensed United States History, Schiller, History of the Revolt of the Netherlands, Young, History of the Netherlands.